While shopping for your new house plan, there are a variety of things to consider. The first questions that people usually ask while searching for the perfect plant are, what kind of light does it need? How often do I water it? How big will it get? When do I repot? These questions are very important. However, if you're a pet owner, a top question you should ask is, is this plant toxic for cats or dogs? The ASPCA has a life-saving list of toxic plants on their website, ASPCA.org. We reference this list while helping our customers find the right plants for their home. If you have a pet, please let us know. Here are a few popular house plants that you may not know are toxic for your furry friend. Toxic for both dogs and cats. Aloe, Alocasia, Begonias, Caladium, Chinese Evergreen, Dracaena, Fiddle Leaf Fig, Jade, Philodendron, Snake Plant, Peace Lily, and Tradescantia Wandering Jew. While there is a long list of toxic plants, don't fret. There are many non-toxic plants that will bring you peace of mind, such as African Violet, Aluminum Plant, Bamboo Palm, Blue Echeveria, Calathea Lancifolia, Cast Iron Plant, Rabbit's Foot Fern, False Aurelia, Mother Fern, Zebra Haworthia, Nerve Plant, Peperomia Ripple, and Ponytail Palm. If you have a pet but love a plant that happens to be toxic, there are ways to make sure your pet will not be hurt. If the plant you love will survive in a closed terrarium or display case, it will be safe from curious pets. Hanging a plant somewhere your cat or dog cannot reach is a possible solution, though you would need to clean up all fallen leaves to be safe. Keeping your toxic plant in a room that is not accessible to pets may also work. Some pets are relentless and creative and may find a way to get to your plant. Of course, the best way to make sure that your pet does not eat a toxic plant is to not have toxic plants around. Do not assume that your well-behaved pet will leave your plants alone. Ask us for help in identifying pet-safe plants for your home. Follow our YouTube and Instagram for weekly plant tips and spotlights.